Hi everybody, feature update number 8, and today there are kind of two new features, and the first one is very simple, and this is the interval that changes when you turn the pitch wheel. So by default it's set to 12 semitones, so the pitch wheel means one octave. But for some performances we just need maybe two semitones. And we can even pitch down when we're turning the wheel up. Okay, I think that's simple. Let's get to the second feature. And the second feature is down here. And here's written sync to oscillator 1, but it's gray, so it's not active. And here we can choose no sync, sync pitch both, sync pitch 1, sync pitch 2. Let's first choose this option, both. But with these settings, it would not make a difference if we enabled this or not. So let me first explain what this syncing is about. And this simply means every time the first oscillator completes one cycle, so it is at this point, the second oscillator is forced to restart no matter on which playing position this oscillator actually is. But now they're in the same pitch, so both are not transposed, both have no fine-tune offset, so these would be synchronized anyway. But when I now transpose the second oscillator, you will hear what happens. I found a visualization of this at Bonedo, so um, let's have a look at this picture. And here on the left side we can see the oscillator 1 and the oscillator 2, and each one has its own wavelength. And on the right side we see this synchronization thing. So every time oscillator 1 restarts, it forces oscillator 2 to restart as well. So in a way, you could imagine this as if oscillator 2 would have the same wavelength, but it uses a frequency that doesn't fit in this wavelength. Okay, let's hear that again. And of course, it's a matter of taste. If we want to hear the first oscillator, or if we just want to hear the synced sound without a carrier. So now, what's up with this pitch thing? Now we pitch both together, which would sound like this. This would be what we expect. But now imagine what happens if we say oscillator 2 would stay at the pitch as it is and we just pitch oscillator 1. So that's a difference. Or if we just pitch oscillator 2, so we modify this value and this actually doesn't really make a pitch sound because it is still forced to base on a frequency that is not pitched. In my opinion, this synced oscillator sound is mostly a use case for lead synthesizers. But hey, you're free to do whatever you want to do. So that's it for today. Hope you have fun with the plugin and bye bye.